today um and by a little bit different i mean very different it's our first ever cider review i've not got a fucking clue that this is gonna end up being an absolute shit show this let's adjust the camera sec because you are all over the fuck yes it's our first ever cider review i can't remember the last time i drank fucking cider um how are you westerns Medium dry organic cider, rich and fruity with honey notes, coming in at 6%. Uh, I think I got this from Lidl, maybe. I'm pretty sure Lidl flat, a couple of quid, no, no more than a couple of quid tops, like about 150. Um, this will be interesting because I know fuck all about cider. And with no bottle opener, professional as always. Bottle opener required. Let's get this open. Okay, no smoke at all. I don't know if that's good or bad. Um, interesting. Look at the colour of that. That is a real... That's a very interesting colour that, that's a real sort of a real dark sort of golden colour. Um yeah. <laughs> it's uh, yeah no fucking head at all, well ish I suppose. Maybe half a finger head. Um to be fair, not that many, not that many bobs. Uh, it was sort of slow and steady bobs. Um, I'm sort of winging this one. I don't really know much about cider, but a bit of a different one. It's a little bit different, isn't it? You know, variety is a spice of life. Let's have a sniff. It smells like a cider. Yeah, it smells like apples. Um, Apples, apples. I'm not really getting the honey, and there's maybe that's there's, there's a real sweetness that maybe I'm mistaking for apples. Um, again, my nose and palate are not really attuned to cider, so it's a bit of a new one for me. But hey ho, smells all right. Jesus, it's stuck in. That's smooth. So you get the honey on the taste, so you get the real apple, like real sort of sweet apple. There's a lovely subtle honey finish to it. It's not too fizzy, and it's not particularly dry. It's sort of there's a bit of dryness, but not not much. It's um, it's quite a nice sort of. That's really nice refreshing cider. Do you know what? That's really good. That's really, really good. Again, there's that, that lovely sort of tart apple flavour. There's a real nice sweet honey afternote to it and a slight dryness. No ABV at all. You told me that was 6%. I don't know. Yeah, I wouldn't be able to tell you. If it was 6 or 3 or whatever, uh, there's no... There's no hint of the alcohol at all. I don't know if that's good or bad. It's nice. Perfectly drinkable. It's not going to set the world on fire. Um, I think I'd rather have a double IPA or something or a hurt on, but um, it's alright. 
Henry Weston's organic cider. Six percent. I think it comes from Lidl. It's all right. It does the job. It's um. I don't know. It's what. It's a fucking cider. What do you want? I'm waiting for some stops to go. Ah, that fucking cider. It's like this. It's like that. You don't know what the fuck you're talking about. I don't. I have no fucking idea. I don't really drink cider. Um, but it's a nice change. It's all right. It's perfectly drinkable. It's nice. It's sweet. It's refreshing. Um, it's all right. Yeah, it's not amazing. But I've had, I've had fucking way worse. <laughs> Possibly a little bit gassy, but um, yeah. For me, it's a winner. Winner with a chicken dinner, as they say. Cheeky one to the thumbnail. Hey. Thanks for watching, guys. Um, please let me know if there's maybe other ciders or if I've gone wrong or what you think about it. I, I, I don't know. Again, I'm, I'm a bit of a sort of newbie to ciders, so please, you know, let me know in the comments what the crack is. <sighs> yeah. Take care, guys. See you in a bit.